In this video we are going to be looking at a company called Chalmers and Chalmers is a company that we've already looked at and we're interested in a couple things. We're looking at their tax liability which in a previous video we figured out to be uh, tax liability. We Let's take a look at what our tax liability it was. We had a uh, $556,000 of taxable income and then after we ran that number through the taxable charts uh, the, for corporations, we found out that we had a taxable liability of a hundred eighty-nine thousand dollars, hundred eighty-nine thousand forty dollars. Well, what we also want to know in this particular equation, what is our marginal tax rate? Now, when you say marginal tax rate, what we're looking for is a marginal tax rate is a percentage, and that's where what category we're in. So where our next dollar is going to be earned. So let's take a look at our categories one more time. In our category, our last category was 34%. You can see this right here, 34%. So our category, our marginal tax rate right now on the next dollar earned is 34%. So now we're looking at the average tax rate as well. So let me just go back over this. We have a tax liability of $189,000. Our marginal tax rate is 34%, or that's where we are here. It's the, the next dollar earned in this particular category. That's the category where the next dollar earned will be paying 34%. Now we want to look at what our average tax rate is. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our tax liability, tax liability, and then we're going to divide it by the EBT. So we're going to take $189,000, $40, and we're going to tax it by the EBT. Now that's the earnings before taxes, if you remember. That is the number 556000 even. So we're going to take that and we we'll do a quick divide. Let's get the calculator up here. So 189,040 divided by 556,000 comes out to be 34%. So our current average tax rate is 34%. So these are the three answers that we're looking for. We want to know what our marginal tax rate was, was this. This is our taxable, that's our tax, that's the tax liability, that's what we owe. And we want to know what our average tax rate is here. Now, the marginal tax rate is important in financial decisions because it's involving incremental income because such income is generally taxed at this rate. So that means that the next dollar that you tax or that you make will be taxed at the 34% rate. So that's important for us to know in business is what our tax rates are. So in this particular video, what we looked at was the Chalmers. It's a continuation of the tax liability how to calculate the, find the marginal tax rate, and how to cal calculate the average tax rate as well.